Hello everybody, Jesse Duxy here. Welcome back to some more Juiced 2. Last time we started with the Rookie League and got around half of the events done. We're gonna get it, get it done in this video. So I'm aiming to do uh, one league per week and there's gonna be more events over the other um, uh, you know what, leagues, so there's gonna be a lot more, uh, um, events and stuff in the, uh, videos, but they also might be longer, unless you prefer me to do, um, for the later leagues, if they get a bit too long, I could, um, upload three videos in one week to, uh, make them less than half hour each or something like that, I don't know, but, uh, We'll figure it, figure it out as we go along. I can, I can of course cut stuff out, so there's that. Alright, we got 45% done with Rookie so far. Let's finish it up and get it done. Okay, so I guess we'll do this event first. Beat Bobby Sawyer in a European circuit race. And we'll do the driver bet. Accumulate 3 seconds of air time, so we have 2.24 seconds already. We just need to do a little more for that, and we need to reach 289 kilometers per hour. And we only have 222, so yeah. So let's do it. Um, there we go. We can finish the four um, remaining goals there, and then do the drift event for the last one, and then we'll do the promotion. So, Lethal Rust in Germany and it's a snow track so that'll be nice there are jumps here so there's that uh, let's go uh, yeah this is uh, that snow track so there's hills going around the uh, the upper U-turn there so we can get some good uh, air over there so we'll have the jump complete uh, so far um, the, uh, USB in the wireless Xbox 360 controller, this is a, um, wired controller, but it's a connecting wired controller, so the USB connecting, the, the USB connecting speed. into the controller is a little, uh, Watch it eat these drivers alive. is a little, uh, what do you call it? A little sensitive, so. Crystal grew up helping her dad wrench cars on a Kansas pig farm, but she ain't no backward country bumpkin when it comes to racing and drifting. Yeah, so even if I just try to um, wiggle it side to side, it could uh, disconnect the controller. So, and where I'm sitting right now, oh, it just went right there. So where I'm sitting right now, I have my uh, Xbox 360. Um, a little distance away so the cord is almost stretched out so hopefully uh, nothing will happen for me to yank the cable out all right so crystal they ju that uh, narrator just talked about her I don't know what she said I'll find out in editing but uh, yeah now she's driving a Mini Cooper so she went from a Mini Cooper to the RX-8 back to the Mini Cooper I don't know why Alright, so we're not going to bet against you anymore, because, uh, yeah. Uh, yeah, we're going to bet against Bobby, and the RDTT, there's Tyra, and Tyrone, and Nick, and Leon, and, uh, me, all the way at the back, of course. Okay, uh, Bobby, let's place a bet against you. Alrighty. Yeah. Uh, let's go 5,000. Okay. I think in the early stages he'll wake it up at the max. What? And I thought you were a player. Are you kidding me? So he'll likely back out if you bet the most. So yeah, it's better to just bet the second most amount, and he'll always well most of the time take it. Alright, I guess I have to place a bet against someone else. Let's try uh, Tyrone here. Um, 
3,000. Are you gonna up it? Yes, you are. Are you gonna back out? No, you're not. Okay, we're good. Fine, but you'll pay at the end. Nope, you're gonna pay at the end because I'm gonna win. So ha 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 ha. All right, all right. We we just need to beat twenty five hundred for the driver bet. Oh, yeah. All right. I don't need to spook anybody. Whoa. 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 This car wants to go sideways. And I don't want it to go sideways. Not now. This is not a drift event. Alright, the speed going downhill would be better to uh, achieve the speed target. Not uphill. So when we get to the other side, we'll speed down and do the jumps at the same time. Or maybe not. What do I know? Crystal, what are you doing? Yeah, she's driving decently well in that Mini Cooper for some reason. At hey, Kiko! The Toyota, the Corolla here is not known for its speed. I can beat these guys, of course, but... Whoa. Alright, how many laps are there? Okay, three laps. So, I have, uh... I have chances here. I don't think I'm gonna get that, uh, I don't think I'm gonna get that speed target in this course. What I gotta do is get my boost up as much as possible. Cause when you get full boost for Nitro in this game, you'll get a big boost. A much sharper boost than the normal boost you get without it, without it being full. So if you can get a full boost, you'll get a much stronger boost of acceleration. Okay, come on. Yep, we got it. We got the jump and we got the blue, uh, speed target, so that was good. We didn't have the nitrous full, but when you're up in the blue near the top, then uh, you'll have a stronger boost regardless. So, And the downhill obviously helped out. So. so not only did we beat Bobby, who still can't crack the top three, we beat Tyrone and got his money money, so yeah, give it to me, I deserve it. Twelve thousand, not bad. What we got? Something's rotating down there behind the podium. What is that? Oh. Don't know what it is, but who cares? We beat the four goals that we were set out to do in this event, and we're good. We just have one more goal to do. We unlocked the promotion, but we have one more event left to do before we will move on for 100%.
in this. You're kicking ass. You've unlocked a promotion event. Pull this off and you get fucked to the next league. If you're getting off on this one, hang tight and go after more goals. It's up to you. I know. I always go for 100% in the rookie league because there's hardly anything here. And maybe League 7 I'll do 100%. It just depends on how many events are in the league and what ones I can actually complete. Because I don't usually do ones that I will have trouble with. And I will still unlock the promotion regardless. Alright, so we will eliminate the event for that one. So we just have the Drift King event left to do because everything else is done. Alright, let's do it. Drift King at Frostbite. Ooh. Uh, alrighty. Let's go. Ooh, this course. It's a B. Or goggles. It looks more like goggles. And the area in the back looks like the bottom set of teeth. For some reason, I don't know why. Okay. Once we get this done, then we'll do the promotion, and then we'll unlock the next stage, and then uh, we'll uh, if you try to maybe stop the video there. Chaos. With up to 10 cars on the track at any time, Drift King's all about scoring the most points before the clock runs out. Remember, you'll get a smackdown for hitting the barriers, but not for trading paint with other cars. Yeah, we know, man. Look out for Tyrone. He's full on aggro. He comes from a fat cat family in Colombia that gave him whatever he wants. Get in his way, and he'll try to run you down. Uh, he's driving the RX-8 now. Leon stole my car and did some upgrades. Not really upgrades, but uh, well, those are decent wheels, of course, but uh, yeah. Bobby's in the Grand Torino. I'm gonna do a bet against him. Kiko is also in the Corolla. She also stole my car. Those are nice um, rims, though. For sure. Power is still in the Miata. She really likes that car for some reason. And there is mine. Which looks a little bare compared to uh, the others, but as I said before, I don't usually like to uh, take a lot of time to. Uh, put some design on the car I don't really have that much time to do so but uh, yeah I could probably do some upgrading in the next video or at the end of this video upgrading um, putting some different body stuff on you know all right let's uh, put the bet on Bobby 4,000 this time so up at the 8 and we're good Bluff. All right, let's get drifting. This will be easy. In the PS2 version, it'll be harder, but it depends on uh, whether you're comfortable drifting or not. But I do say it's actually easier to drift on the Xbox 360 version. You're not going to lose any points for hitting any of the cars in the way, but uh, you will lose around half, around half the points if you hit a wall, so be careful about that. Other than that, don't go heavy on the throttle, feather the throttle, use the handbrake if you need to to turn the car into sideways motion. And go from there. But also don't um, watch the speed of the car. You don't want it to keep sliding towards a wall. If, it, if you see it sliding towards the wall, then slow down a little bit. It's all about feathering the throttle. 
I'm gonna make it to two million. Let's see if I can make it to two point. Well, no, I'm not gonna make it to two point five. The more sideways you go, the more points you get, but. You need more control than um, speed. Well, I almost made it to uh, 2.5 mil. I got 2.46, which is not bad, not bad. Oh, wow. 100 more points, I would have had 2.4666. Wow. Uh, Bobby, you still suck. He has not cracked the top three at all, which is interesting. All right. Tyrone and Leon will uh, be the two guys that will uh, keep up with you most of the time in the events here, so there's that. All right. Got the five grand for the event win and then 16 grand for the bet. A lot of times you'll win more from the bet than you will with the uh, event, which is interesting. Okay, we are good to go on that. Um, I can probably uh, do a little uh, upgrade stuff here. Um, let's see. How can I blow? Okay, let's go into the performance because uh, we can actually upgrade more. So yeah, let's uh, do that. Uh, beat car challenge. We gotta beat the BMW M3 GTR because why not? It's all up for grabs again at Air Trauma. Yep. Driver X, we gotta beat him. He's obviously upgraded all the way to 100 Elite. So, he's a cheater, all right. All right, we gotta, we gotta beat them. We gotta beat them. We will get a head start, but we gotta stay ahead. Oh, come on. I can do this. Come on, I can do this, I can do this, I can do this. Woo! It is harder on the Xbox 360 version. Oh, he's already caught up. Ah, dude, what? I meant to look behind the car, not change the camera angle. Wow, that's weird. Okay. But yeah, he got pretty close there. If we didn't have the uh, few second head start, then yeah, he would have definitely beat us. He is a cheater, all right. All right, I'm just gonna go random. Eighteen point five, so that is definitely better. All right, what is this? Corvette V five one, another beat car challenge. Oh my god! Oh lord! Whew. That is a weird looking tractor gun. Hmm. Wanna dance? Shake that junk in your trunk to the Bayside Hustle. We are going to have a little harder time doing this because uh, the Corvette uh, is pretty uh, pretty quick on the straight. Um, pretty quick on the straight, so we got to make the most of our start here. We do have uh, more of a head start this time though, which is nice. Oh boy, 
Come on, we got this, we got this, we got this. Oh, that is pretty, pretty cool. Oh, stop doing that again. I did it again. What the hell, man? Why did I do that, man? Pushing the right stick down is look back, not left bumper, which is the, the look back in some other games. So I'm kind of used to hitting that button instead. All right, so we beat that one pretty easily. So as long as you're not, um, moving the car all over the place and not hitting the walls. If you can make it through the corners pretty quickly and use a bit of nitrous to boost out of the corners, then uh, you're gonna be fine. It is really warm in here, my God. I do have my air conditioner in my room, but uh, I'm not having it on while we're recording because then you'll hear that more than me. Um, so yeah, uh, let's see, um, there is something else here, um, here's League 5, and you can see that we can't go down past this, but there is something else that you can get at the Max League, so, we have Prototype. And what that means is we'll have the um, prototype package for the level 3 power, handling, and weight, but also extreme nitro, which I believe is the mo most powerful nitro. And we can only get the prototype mods at the max league for performance, so it'll give us um, all the... I think what it does is... If we just uh, do the um, um, upgrades normally, like uh, level 2 power handling and weight will probably be at the max in the blue bar, but the prototype will push us all the way up to 100. I think that's what that does. So, I'm slowly remembering bits of the game here. But yeah, now that we're done with that, let's go do the promotion event and get that done. We're gonna destroy the competition because we're fully upgraded right now at this point. All right, Nitrous Maximus. And we're gonna get more than our money back because uh, this pays a lot. So let's do it. Sugar Eliminator. And we are, the selling value is at 30,000 for this one now. So this is what the car looks like now. Um, I changed it to a uh, b nice blue metal up there. I changed the racing seat and the steering wheel to a blue color. And I changed the uh, spoiler here to uh, that, so... And I changed the wheels to uh, that, so hopefully you guys are not gonna... <sighs> destroy me in the comments for that. Hopefully it still looks good. I think it looks better than uh, what I had before. The blue definitely makes it pop more than uh, the dark gray. So, there's that. And the spoiler, I think, looks a bit better. Yeah. Okay. Now we're in a new location, Italy. Live from Italy. Nitrous Addict's favorite track, Nitrous Maximus. I know. This is a circuit eliminator event. We already know that, but thank you. There's no love lost between Leon and Tyrone. Leon drives just as hard, but without the toot, so other drivers respect him and the crowds love him. I see. Well, I'm still not gonna bet against him. I'm still gonna bet against Bobby because he will give the most to the bet. Straight up call. I'm in. You better be. Okay. Let's start the race and uh, destroy these guys. Maybe spook someone along the way. Two, one, 
Yeah, let's spook Bobby. Come here, buddy. Wait, you're not my buddy. I'm still gonna spook you though, come on. Wow, you're taking a long time to be spooked. There we go, we got him. Hey! Lay off my car, yeah? That hurts. Oh wow, I'm still passing you even when you're using nitrous. How embarrassing for you, man. Hey! Get away from me. You're not allowed to pass me, punk. Hey, hopefully the recording is coming out great for you guys. I know I'd much rather use the uh, Live Gamer 4K capture card which is stronger and better than the Live Gamer Mini but uh, for consistent consistency in my recordings right now I'm using the uh, Live Gamer Mini because I, I don't really trust that the Live Gamer, 4, uh, Live Gamer 4K will actually produce some uh, consistent recordings for the time being because uh, I don't really want that audio cracking to come back and I don't want to have to redo some of the stuff because some of these games are auto saved and I can't go back and redo them after they've been saved so that's why I've been not uh, for the for the last several videos of Hot Shots Golf 4 that's why I've been uh, waiting on saving the game after the end of the event so I can be sure that the recording came out good before I save but with games like this Juice 2 and some other newer games you can't you don't have that luxury because it's auto saved oh so you can't really uh, afford to uh, miss it otherwise you may have to start the game over or try and redo what you were doing if the game will let you redo stuff or just do post commentary and move on from there so that's why I had to uh, do some post commentary for two of my videos with Hot Shot Score 4 when I was facing off against Louise and doing a tournament with Louise because of uh, the fact that uh, the audio cracked and I had saved without even waiting on it. Yep, we got the top speed right there, 322 kilometers per hour. And with that juiced uh, 2 logo at the top there of the nitrous bar, we were able to have a full strong boost. And extreme nitro when we get to max league barb for this car will uh, we'll see how just how powerful it is that is a sub corner right there who's behind me is it bobby of course it's bobby will you stop moving the camera control stick i don't want to lose because of you nope it's not bobby it's most likely Tyrone. I don't even know if Bobby was eliminated, but this is the last uh, lap right here, so let's just boost to the finish line, leave him in the dust, and call it a day. There we go. Win an eliminator event. Even if you haven't, um, yep, Tyrone and um, Bobby was in third place. Wow, he got in third place for once? Wow, that's not gonna last. But yeah, um, what was I talking about? Even for the promotion event, you c if you haven't uh, completed all of the goals before then, you can still complete some goals during the promotion event, so there's still that. 
Wow, Bobby's looking pissed right there. And Tyrone, wow. You guys have the same animation for some reason. So sad. Okay, now I'm up, up now I'm up to $135,000. Oh my god. We're not gonna we're not gonna get a new car yet though. I'm thinking of uh, getting a new car after every two leagues. So we're using the Corolla for League uh, Rookie League and League Seven, and then we'll uh, go to a new car for League Six and Five, and we'll we'll do it that way. A car every two leagues, because you can still upgrade the existing car and use it until the max league. Because after League 5, you can't use it anymore. For the Corolla, anyway. So you have to buy a new car and do that. I believe so, anyway. I'm going to test um, a couple things out when, when we get to that point. But uh, we're just going to upgrade existing car. But for now, after, since we beat the Rookie League, there are some new cars available. So let's check out what those are. The car list, when you do them, it's always going to be the same. So we just have to go past 15. Because this is the the last um, available car before League 7 unlocks. So since we just beat the Rookie League, we just got 18 new cars. So let's check them out. We got the Honda Civic SI, so we can... So we can buy it on League 7, and Max League is 4, so there's, you can use it for 4 leagues. Whereas the Toyota Corolla, you can use it for 1, 2, 3, yeah, 4 leagues, okay, makes sense. Alright, Toyota Celica, or, I think it's Celica, you can correct me in the comments below. But uh, yeah, we know this car pretty well from Underground 1 and 2. What's this car in Underground 1? I think it was. Uh, I I never know how to pronounce this name here. Pugio or Puget? I don't know. If you uh, know how to correctly pronounce it, then let me know in the comments below. But uh, yeah, this is also the car from Underground 2, 206. I think it's not the G GTI version though. I think it's just the regular 206 in Underground 2. This is the GTI right here. Um, so we got League 7 and then League 5. Oh, you can only use this one for three leagues. Eww, that's not good. This one also for three leagues. And the Toyota MR2 GT Sports. Honestly, I like the look of this one more than the regular MR2. Because with the... Yeah, that, that back end just looks better to me. So there's that. The Lexus IS300. Ooh. We know this one. From Underground. I don't know if it's in Underground 1. I don't think it was. But in Underground 2, that's when it started. And in Need for Speed Most Wanted, it was one of the starter cars. So yeah, that's pretty cool. Three leagues being used, though. And did someone arrive home? I don't know. All right, uh, Volkswagen GTI, Golf GTI. We know this one very well, actually. The Seat Leon Cupra R. Ooh, interesting looking car here. Eclipse, Mitsubishi Eclipse GS, GTS Coupe. A nice looking car there. Acura Integra Type R. Yeah, I know a lot of people like this car. Front wheel drive though, which is interesting. Um, but yeah. Acura RSX Type S. I have used this car before in Underground 2 and it's, it's not bad, but uh, the handling could be better, but it, it is a front wheel drive, so. Mitsubishi Eclipse GSX. I think this is the first case of Oh, the first car in this game that you unlock that is four-wheel drive. And this is a good one to have. It only, it sucks that you can only use it in three leagues, but, uh... This will have a pretty good hookup off the line, starting line. 
and the handling is usually pretty good too. And you could use this to drift, but it's not recommended. Real wheel drive cars in this game, you could drift better with those. Um, but I, I could theoretically drift with four wheel drive and front wheel drive in this game. It's not that hard, but it is not as easy as real wheel drive, obviously. A Fiat Coupe 2.0 Turbo. That is a, to me, that's a little weird looking back end, but that's Fiat for you. And apparently, uh, people have arrived home. All right, what is, ooh, we know this one from Need for Speed Most Wanted. Mitsubishi Eclipse GT. Um, League 4, uh, Mitsubishi FTO. My control stick here likes to rotate the camera on its own, for so, um, here we go. Nissan Skyline R32 GTS T Type M. A good drift car, but you can also use this car longer than the other cars. So this one's pretty nice to have. It also costs more though. And we have this one, the Skyline GTR R34. You can use this way use this one all the way to the end of the career. Four-wheel drive. And it's the most expensive so far. Ford Falcon XR8. I think I was using this um, in my previous uh, playthrough of this game on my channel that I tried to do but uh, couldn't do more of it. That's why I'm redoing this playthrough. Um, I think I was using the Falcon at some point. So, yeah, it's still a pretty decent car. Audi S3, four-wheel drive as well, but not as long to use as the others. So yeah, that's all of the new cars we have there, and we will just we will just upgrade the Corolla to use in League Seven, and then we'll go to a new car from there. We'll keep this car until League Five, and then I will showcase the prototype upgrade, and we'll also test and see if we can actually even use this car in League 4. We'll, we'll worry about that then. But yeah, hope you enjoyed this video. Leave a like if you enjoyed this and uh, subscribe if you are enjoying the content. It really helps me out. So yeah, later.